All right, Danny, right. is it ready, dude? Let's Are you do ready? It. Let's do it! Let's go! Woo! In the air! Get in it! Oh! What's up guys, Matt here. I had a crazy idea floating around. I've came across this meme of a guy standing in front of four fans with a controller. Sure it's a hoax, but I wanted to give a whack at it and see if we can accomplish it. So right here, we got four box fans and we're gonna see if we can make it fly. All right, we got this prop right here, actually a fan blade. It's not gonna do what I want it to do. It's super flimsy, it's not gonna provide enough thrust. So I'm gonna have to figure out a solution later about propellers. Got both the cages off, basically got the fan down to its frame. But there is a problem with this motor. This big boy right here runs on 110 volts and also the RPMs are not gonna be enough to give us some thrust. So I'm just gonna rip this guy out and we'll figure out a solution for a motor and we'll go from there. The fans are taken apart. We're probably gonna put these frames together like so. All right, let's go in here and see if Chad can give me a hand. Yo, Chad. If I just bolt this together, it's gonna wobble and shake and it's uh, not gonna work probably. So we need it to be as rigid as possible, but still try to keep it on the light side. We're just gonna kind of spread these apart and then put a piece of wood. Obviously you can't make the wood go like this without cutting one of them. So I'll cut both of them and actually get them to go like this and get cutting. Instead of just trusting my math, I'll just trust my eyeballs. Tricky fit. It's actually better than a glue joint. Gonna get some bolts and screws and uh, screw it together, and then we can move on to the motor mounts. Oh yeah, it's strong this way. It's not so strong this way. That's some really thin aluminum. Obviously not strong this way, but it is this way. I'm gonna go on the outside. I believe we should just be able to rivet it in place. Time lapse. Whoosh. Now we need to put some motor mounts in. Thanks to our, uh, our guys over at Brother Hobby, they actually hooked us up with some motors for some of their uh, bigger stuff. So I'm gonna take the, uh, the whole pattern of this, put it into a laser file, cut out some wood for it, and make a plate to go between these two middle bars. Now we can uh, place them down and figure out the center, and then uh, punch some holes. Now I can give back to Matt. Okay. Oh yeah, that's not going anywhere. So, one down, three to go. Let's get this thing going and gotta get this big old fan. This frame is awesome, Chad did a great job on it. And now I just have to figure out how to mount all my electronics. All right, installed. I got a lot of Zelda in my head right now, dude. So I get like heart up or stamina up. <laughs> That would like increase my stamina, I think. I'm gonna take these ESCs out of the package. What's sweet about these is they're newer on the market. Our buddies over at Next FPV sent us these. They're actually for X-Class uh, drones and they burst at 200 amps. So when I put the bigger prop on our motors, the 16 inch prop I'm gonna put on, Tri-Blade, uh, these ESCs should be able to handle it. What an ESC is and what it does is electronic speed control. And that is what actually sends the signals to your motor to adjust the RPM and give it left or right. This is the guy that actually is gonna spin up that motor. Quads off, I got battery plugged in, nothing's armed, I can't do anything with the controller. Now I want to start my quad and apply battery voltage. There's starting my quad. So it's going to be pretty sweet. So we get to use the original switch that the fan came with. I really wanted to do that to kind of keep the genuine box fan feel. There we go. So these are going out, this going out. Dang. Air mode. All right, we got these sweet 16 inch props Master Air Screw sent us. So we're gonna put these on, we're gonna put the cages back on, and we're gonna go fly. 
All right, before we fly this, I gotta give a shout out to Maka. They're doing some pretty cool stuff for beginners. If you wanna learn how to fly a drone, Maka's a great system. You get all these pucks right here, you go on the app store, you download the app. When you go out to fly, all you do is take these pucks, put them out in the field, put this one on your drone, and then once you fly over them, it acts as a digital gate. It takes learning how to fly a drone and turns it into a game. It keeps track of all your times, that way you can race against your friends. This is gonna be sweet. Oh, oh dang, you got some wind out here, man. I'm a little nervous, Dude, man. I'm nervous. I'm, I'm a little nervous, so we'll see. Uh, we'll see what goes on here. From Facebook meme. Yeah, to exactly. Reality, right? From Facebook meme to reality. That was my goal. So it still looks like box fans. Yes, it does. It doesn't really look like a drone which is awesome, so let's power her up, dude. That's you you wanna do the honors for me? Dude, what do you need me to do? You mean to turn these things on? Dude, you just gotta turn the one. And I think it which is, is it? that one. This one? Yep. What power setting would you like? Oh, uh, we're gonna go to setting one. One, okay. Boom, we're on one, bro. Oh, and there I goes. Heard me. <laughs> 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 dude, yes. We're gonna go a little forward, which, see? It's all reverse, so hold on one second. I can actually change it in my controller. Nice. And safety you can first. Change it on the controller? Yeah, let's check it now. You Going good? back, forward. All right, Danny, all right. is it ready, dude? Let's Are you ready? It. Let's do it! Let's go! Woo! Woo! Get in the air! Get in the air! Oh! What? Yeah! <laughs> Dang it! Dang it! That's like full throttle, too. <laughs> take it, dude! Oh, yeah, we're gonna have to take the grates off. We're gonna have to do Josh's idea. As much as I wanted the grates to be on so that it looked like fans, I think they're just causing an issue. All right, guys, again. we took the grates off the bottom. That was Josh's idea. Hopefully, it'll give us a little bit more thrust. Nice. And we're just gonna give it another whirl. Keep trying Stay. it. Let's do it. Good luck, buddy. Feeling good. Yes! 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 How do you feel right yeah! now? Yeah! So excited! Dude. Should I try a roll before it lands? Should I try a roll? What about a 360? I'm gonna go for the roll! I'm gonna go for it! I had to go for the roll, oh, man. Dude, Let's go out and check it out. Wait a minute. What? Oh. Wait. Wait, yeah, can we just bend it back? Oh, yeah. We're good. I kind of figured that the frame, if it had any crashes, it was going to bend. But I'm excited that it was up in the air, you know, and dude, did a barrel roll. Thanks, guys, for joining me on this journey. Uh, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and let me know in the comments what kind of quad projects you want to see next. See you later.